Shepard, how can I help? Have you got oh, a minute to talk? Of course. Plague on Omega dealt with plenty of time to analyze collector intelligence. Impressive laboratory setup. Missed working for operations with a budget. AI in particular, very helpful. Best setup I've seen since work with Special Tasks Group. Is your assistant Daniel settling in all right? Quite well. Safe and secure. Neighborhood mostly quiet with plague gone. Left him the security mechs just in case. Can't be too careful. Also tired of mechs. Noisy. Never used them in STG. It must have been frustrating working on Omega with such a limited facility. No, loved it. Limited facility presents challenge. Save greatest number of people using limited resources. Security threats, gangs, mercenary groups add additional difficulty. Quite enjoyable. Plague stretched abilities to limit. Couldn't have asked for more. Also, enjoy saving people, of course. Helping the helpless, greater good, all that too. Nice. Mm, Retirement after SDG work complete. Tell me more about the Solarian Special Task Group. Respected organization. Clandestine. Handles difficult assignments with limited oversight. Recon, analysis, occasional wet work. Identify problems, have neutralization options ready should need arise. Model for Council Spectres based on Special Tasks Group. Very similar. How so? Similar in what way? Solarians lack numbers. Brute strength, military prowess, have to rely upon stealth, intelligence. Agents trusted, given wide operative freedom, Spectre's similar. Given goal, told to accomplish. Better. Funded, of course. <laughs> Didn't have to buy our own weapons. You said you were in the Special Tasks Group. What kind of research were you doing? Not simply research. Several recon missions. Covert, high risk, served under young captain named Kirihi. Studied Krogan genophage, took water, tissue samples from Krogan colonies. I met Kirihi. I worked with an SDG captain named Kirihi. His team helped me destroy Saren's cloning facility on Vermeer. Heard Kirihi died in Vermeer. Not enough equipment for operation. Still managed to take down facility. Good captain. Dedicated. Bit of a cloaca, though. Loved his speeches. Hold the line. Personally prefer to get job done and go home. Probably military bravado. Jargon. Chest pounding. Uh, no offense. <laughs> None taken. <laughs> he didn't call him an arsehole. He called him a cloaca. That's so funny. Nice talking with you, Morton. I should get back to work. Need to study. So much data. Here, if you need me. I loved how he took the piss out of his speech, the whole the line speech. <laughs> Commander, I assume, I assume everything everything is going, going well up here. Joker, what? I can tell when it's listening. I am always listening, Mr. Moreau. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I assume everything is going well up here. Good for now. Fractured my thumb on the mute, but I think I made my point. That's it for now. See you, Commander. One of the girls in navigation thinks she might be pregnant. Even aboard a Cerberus vessel, life finds a way. Did you just quote Jurassic Park? Good on you. I have to say, that Jacob? Mm -hmm. He seems pretty intense. Okay. I wonder if he likes Japanese girls with a pension for kleptomania. <laughs> I have a penchant for Japanese girls. I don't know what it is. I just love how cute they sound when they speak in their native tongue. It just It's amazing how they sound so cute but sexy at the same time. It's very strange. Also, I love their um, outfits that they have. Like some yukatas and kimonos they wear. Oh my god, they look so beautiful. Absolutely beautiful designs. I mean, I, to be fair, I'm in love with Japanese culture, really, so that kind of helps... Uh, with it really, but yeah, love Japanese girls. Anyway. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. Dr. Jack West, you alright? Commander, I very much enjoyed sharing that ice brandy with you. But I hope I wasn't too unprofessional. Brandy goes straight to my head. I enjoyed it. It's nice to see you let your hair down. Well, promise me we'll share a bottle every year. The next one is on me. Fair enough. I've got green across the board. The forward tanks are buoyant and elevated. Are you talking about the Normandy or Miranda? I'm talking about the one that's covered and protected, not bouncing in the breeze. I don't know. Operative Lawson's uniform is very official. It always makes me stand at attention. <laughs> Such a dog. God damn it, you two. Just get together already, honestly. 
Yeah, what's funny about that is that I was looking at Dr. Charquas and I thought to myself, Jesus Christ, that is a bit fucking skin tight. I'm like, how do you work in a suit like that? Alright. Let's go get that Kroger. The dossier doesn't say if Okir is on this planet by choice. Assume hostiles. There is only one measure of success. Kill or be killed. Perfection is your goal. Loudspeakers. Someone likes the sound of their voice. I won't stop bleeding. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... You son of a bitch. Doesn't look that bad, actually. He doesn't need to know that. <laughs> I knew it wasn't berserkers. Ah, not at range. You're mercs. Or alliance. I'm not... I'm not telling you anything. But a metagel change your mind? I've got a nice application of metagel ready to go. But if you'd rather I just keep walking. Son of a bitch. I just... I don't know anything. I just shoot the overflow from the labs. The old Krogan up there, he, he's really been cleaning house lately. Jador hired him to make her an army, but the Krogan he creates are insane. So we use them for live ammo training. It's all wow. crap. I don't get paid enough to goddamn bleed out. Outpost 4, Jador wants us to move. We need coordinates on that Krogan pack. Give them the wrong directions. You heard the man on the radio? He needs direction. I... I don't have the info they want. You showed up before I could get my normal sightings. You have other problems. You have other issues at the moment. Patrol, uh... Uh, pack sighting east of Station 2. Yeah. Copy. East of 2. Son of a bitch! They'll run blind into Krogan. You should have thought about that before starting to use them for target practice. If you start limping now, you might find a shady spot before you bleed out. Oh, shit. Oh. Adding insult to injury. Literally. Necessary. Maybe not. Maybe not. Felt good, though. Good Come on. Our warlord is somewhere in Jador's lab. Right. Weapons down. It's okay. You are different. New. You don't smell like this world. Seven night cycles, and I have felt only the need to kill. But you... Something makes me speak. Night cycles? Seven days? Seven days... Is this Sadako? Lab bred but full grown. They must breed them full size, ready to kill. Not much improvement over regular mercs if they need training. Bred... to kill? No. I kill because my blood and bone tell me to. But it's not why I was flushed from Glass Mother. Survival is what I hear in my head. Against the enemy that threatens all my kind. But I failed, even before waking. That is what the voice in the water said. That is why I wait here. So you're indoctrinated into believing that. How can you speak if you're only a week old? There was a scratching sound in my head. And it became the voice. It taught things I would need. Walking, talking, hitting, shooting. Then the voice said I was not perfect. And the teaching stopped. And now I am here. Interesting. Raised, then rejected. Control group, failed test. I don't know, but I am not perfect. Okir's voice? Did he speak to you while you were in your tank? I heard the voice, not like now, with ears, inside. I called it Father. It liked that, but it was disappointed. I'm not what it needs me to be. A breeding program, trying to escape Genophage effects? Escape? Escape was never whispered. Survive, resist, ignore. How did you disappoint the voice? I don't know. It was decided before I left Tank Mother. I was not perfect. If Mercenary was correct, Krogan prone to mental instability. I don't know of that, but I'm not perfect. Hmm. You're supposed to be part of a mercenary army. Do you remember Jador? I know that name. It causes anger, but also laughter. It is not a name that will be sung when we march. I don't know what that means. But I have heard it many times. Can you show me the laboratory? 
I need to speak with Okir. The Glass Mother. She is up past the broken parts, behind many of you fleshy things. I will show you. You fleshy things. Key aspect of Krogan. Did you really need to Fleshy move that? Things are slow when big things are in your way. Why don't you come with Can us? Can you show us the way? Help us fight to the lab? No. A Krogan refusing to fight? I will That's... fight if they come, but I feel it deep that I must wait. I kill, but only here. I am not perfect, but I have purpose. I must wait until called, released. Oh God. Completely indoctrinated him. Not a lot of room to maneuver. Stay short. Shepard, don't shoot. You know me. Oh my God, Rana, how are you? I shut down the security cams as soon as I saw it was you. Never thought I'd say it, but I'm glad it's you shooting up the place. Sorry, Rana Thanoptis. You let me go when you destroyed Saren's lab on Vermeer. Had to outrun a nuke in a utility pod, but it's still a second chance. Well, I'm glad you managed to survive them. I assume you have a good reason for being at this lab. Don't worry, I'm not wasting the chance you gave me. My work here, strictly beneficial. Not for the mercs. Jador's on a standard power trip. But Okir is trying to do something good, even if his methods are a little extreme. That's one way of putting it. Everyone deserves a second chance, right? And sometimes giving one pays off. I take care of my debts. Finding you in a place like this makes me think letting you go was a mistake. You don't want that. We agree on that. Don't worry. I plan on staying as far away from anything to do with you as possible. <laughs> now, if you don't mind, I'm gonna run like hell before you blow the place or something. I know how you work. Should have killed her. Too much knowledge without ethical boundaries. Mon, we don't have to kill every single person we come across. Okay. It's about time. The batteries on these tanks will not wait while you play with these idiotic mercs. I take it you're okay. You don't seem particularly caged. Or grateful that I'm here. You may claim to be here to help, but the formerly deceased Shepherd is not a sign of gentle change. Surprised? Old Krogan should know you. I'm sure Rana has already revisited your actions on Vermeer. I didn't have a lot of room for finesse. If there'd been any other solution, I'd have considered it. But I approve. Saren's pale horde were not true Krogan. Numbers alone are nothing. The mistake of an outsider. One that these mercenaries have also made. I gave their leader my reject for her army. But she grows impatient. It's time for you to take me out of here. Personal issues irrelevant. Here for the collectors. I see. Yes. Collector attacks have increased. A human concern. My requests were focused elsewhere. I acquired the knowledge to create one pure soldier. With that, I will inflict upon the Genophage the greatest insult an enemy can suffer. To be ignored. Your methods are extreme, but you know how to deconstruct a threat. Will you help us? Perhaps I can strike a deal to secure passage. But my prototype is not negotiable. It is the key to my legacy. Attention! I have traced the Krogan release. Oh, here, of course. I'm calling blank slate on this project. Gas these commandos and start over from Okir's data. Flush the tanks! Weak will. She'll kill my legacy with a damn valve. Shepard, you want information on the collectors? Stop her. 
Two try to access contaminants in the storage bay. You could just start over like she plans to. What's the big deal? This tank is pure. It involved as much trial as data. Starting over will not duplicate it. It must survive. Jador will be with the rejected tanks. Kill her. I will stay and do what must be done. Kent! Alarms in the lab? What's that Krogan doing up there? Shepard, the lab alarms coincided with the system's failure. The remaining lab systems are unprotected, and I have gained limited access. According to lab scanners, the room is flooded with toxins and Okir's personal life signs are failing rapidly. I recommend haste. didn't just leave the room. Why would someone so fanatical sacrifice himself for one Krogan? Delusional. Unlikely one Krogan, however strong, could have impact Okir wanted. Am... Um, almost certain. Suggest leaving it. Why the hell would we leave it? Professional jealousy, maybe? Afraid he'll make your genophage obsolete? No. But Krogan, genetically dangerous, socially dangerous as well, have enough enemies without adding this. Normandy, Okir is a no-go, but we have a package that needs retrieval. And he's a big one. Yes, he is. Probably the most brilliant character aside Garrus and Tali. I just love Grunt so much. Bringing the Krogan to study makes sense, but I have concerns about waking it. Yeah, you've said that a few times now. A normal Krogan is dangerous. This one was created and likely educated by a madman. That excited, are you? I see everyone's enjoying the new paperweight. Concerns? We don't know anything about it, Commander. That's the fun part. I know. You don't find that interesting? Krogan fight well at close quarters. Perhaps awakening him in a confined space wouldn't be prudent. Noted. The cargo hold is safe enough while I decide what to do with them. Just trust me. Have you got a minute to talk? Yes, we'd like that, actually. Talked about work earlier. Time with special tasks group studying genophage. It wasn't entirely honest. Lie of omission. Also, other kinds need to clear the air. Mission too important to keep secrets. Work on genophage was more than just study. What was the special task group doing with the Krogan genophage? Study at first, as I said, but uncovered surprising data. Krogan population was increasing at faster rate than expected. Krogan were adapting to genophage, overcoming disease. That's good news, surely. The genophage was a terrible mistake. It nearly destroyed the Krogan and their culture. Now they have a chance to recover. Naive viewpoint. Krogan too dangerous to allow unchecked birth rate. Look at Krogan rebellions. Personally led a science team. Geneticists, chemists, sociologists, mathematicians. Created new version of genophage. Released it onto Chanka, other Krogan-centric areas. Restabilized Krogan population. What you did was wrong, Morden, and you know it. At the end of the day, that's like me killing you because I'm nowhere near as intelligent as you. It's moronic completely moronic. The genophage was a mistake bordering on a war crime. Recreating it is unforgivable. Don't want me on team? Don't bring me. Can stay here. Work on collector research. But no apologies. Did what was right. Hope you do the same if necessary. Should get back to work. Talk more later. Next time tissue synthesis has to compile. Good for free time. Fair enough, Morn. If you don't want to come along, I don't really care at the end of the day. But still, you should realize what you've done was wrong. Commander. I assume everything is going well up here? This thing wants to fire me over a joke! Okay, I said I'd flash the AI core, but I was kidding. And we'd only lose a few systems. Nosy ones. To clarify, human resources adjustments are not actually under my authority. Then why? Why are you always picking on me? My replies were intended to provoke, though not to cause distress. 
Your reactions are atypical of most humans. You are interesting. <laughs> Edie manipulated you. Edie, were you intentionally egging him on? What part of your programming covers that? Nothing in the restrictions imposed upon me forbids active observation techniques. Mr. Moreau's performance actually improved under duress. I never figured the coming overlords would be so annoying. I'm just... I'm done. <laughs> That's it for now. See you, Commander. Good job, BD. Blokes work better under stress. And I know, it works. Can be detrimental to them as well at the end of the day as well. Like, the one thing that you don't want to hear as a bloke is like, you know, when you're trying to do something and then your bird or your missus comes behind you and she's like, What? Can't you do it? Shepard and I don't take threats lightly. I suggest you relax. Not your name. Mine. I'm trained. I know things. But the tank, Okir couldn't implant connection. His words are hollow. Warlord, legacy, Grunt. Grunt. Grunt was among the last. It has no meaning. It'll do. I am Grunt. If you are worthy of your command, prove your strength and try to destroy me. You wouldn't prefer Okir? Or Legacy? It's short. Matches the training in my blood. The other words are big things I don't feel. Maybe they fit your mouth better. I feel nothing for Okir's clan or his enemies. I'll do what I'm bred to do. Fight and determine the strongest. But his imprint has failed. Without a reason that's mine, one fight is as good as any other. Might as well start with you. I have a good ship and a strong crew. A strong clan. You'd make it stronger. If you're weak and choose weak enemies, I'll have to kill you. Our enemies are worthy. No doubt about that. Mm. Mm. That's acceptable. I'll fight for you. Good choice. I'm glad you saw reason. <laughs> <laughs> Offer one hand but arm the other. Exactly. Why, Don't Shepherd, let the right hand know what the left hand's if doing. If I find a clan, if I find what I, I want, I will be honored to eventually pit them against you. What is it that Sun Tzu said? He said one of the better battles to fight are the ones where you don't have to hurt each other. Or better yet, just fight, really. Shepard. Just checking in, making sure you're acclimatizing. Humans talk too much, like the tank. Come back later. What are your thoughts about our mission? I fight. Doesn't matter who for. Did Okir give you any imprints about the collectors? I see blurry ships, guesswork about strength. Nothing to help pick a weak spot and tear. Okir spent all his time on old hatreds. Whatever he had, it was used up when he made me. Anything in your tank imprints that can make use of the resources we found? Hmm. Might have something I could put together. Don't know how useful it will be. I can give you a shotgun now. Shepard. What do you think about the crew? Good bunch if they stay out of my way. Dead bunch if they don't. Train them good if you want to take on collectors. Some of these aliens are too smooth. Too smooth. I love this guy. That's all for now. Shepard. You take care, Grump.
Garrus? Need me for something? Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Still doing his calibrations, bless him. 